Let's make a jig. For this jig, I'm doing something a little different. I'm just gonna use some tips that I've already cut. I'll be using one eighth ounce sickle hooks, number four size. Two different colors of feathers of uh, neck hackle, uh, flow orange. And I'll also be using the green chartreuse. For the chenille, I'll be using uh, chartreuse pepper. And I'm gonna be adding quite a bit of flash in this one. And the flash I'm using is a crystal flash. Uh, mega Crystal Flash Chartreuse, which may or may not be a challenge for me to actually use to tie into this. So I've already got my jig mounted up. I guess we'll be using, I'm going to switch to the white. I get the thread in my spool. Get it in a little hole and then suck it through, except I went around the shaft on the spool there, so that wasn't very smart. So we'll try that again. First time went real well, second time. There we go. Get that thread base down. <clears throat> We're going to start with the two orange tips on the bottom. One tip's a little wonky. Then we're going to put in a bunch of the flash, which I haven't decided how to. Didn't want to pre cut it because then I'd have pieces of flash everywhere. Which probably would have been. A smarter thing to do, but I didn't. So try and match up the ends and we'll double it up. And we'll do it again. And from there we'll put it on. twist now I've got my flash but I also have a whole bunch of loops need cut. I think that's got them. Okay. So now we've got the flash in, which can be shortened a little bit. We're going to finish it with 
a little bit of the green. And then we'll come back in with the uh, chartreuse pepper chenille. Finish it with a whip, which is just overlapping threads to tie it down. <clears throat> then I usually use a touch of hard as nails just to lock down that little bit of thread that's left. I just do a dab just around where that last thread was. It's never had one come untied. usually lose the jigs before I uh, ruin a jig. So there we have a orange and green crappie jig. I might touch up some of that a little bit.